previously on Champ Coastal. Didn't think I'd be back this season, did you? I'm back. I feel like there's got to be someone else that's returning. Yeah. yeah. I don't think they would throw you in here by yourself. Yeah. Nice. Uh, coastal. Yeah. You see that on the bottom? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. On that yeah. little black, yeah. little picture frame? Yeah. yeah. And then Contender. We're trying to figure that part out. Who the hell else is coming? Be on the watch out because what if he knows something that we don't? Everything's in the air right now. The fucking crow has left the nest. The four of us, Anthony, um, Angel, Anne Marie, and I, already said we were gonna stick together. Cheers to the four of us! I'm ready for my popcorn to eat it and watch this all unfold. Well, um, I have something for you. You got this, <sighs> just don't faint. My name is Michael Noah, I'm 28 years old and I am from Durant, Oklahoma. My occupation right now is I work at my casino, um, Choctaw, which is my tribe, um, as a host cashier. My hobbies are um, actually dancing, um, you know, hanging out with friends, hanging out with my family a lot. I have modeled before for a couple of photographers, um, but I wouldn't say it's uh, actually like a super professional thing. It was more like up and coming photographers who needed a model. So pretty much just like amateur photo shoots, things like that. My favorite moment in season one actually was at the end when uh, everybody was kind of um, talking about what had happened and their experience. And I think that's like when a lot of people kind of shown like what was going on and like how everything turned out and kind of the drama behind everything. But it was still, it was good because everybody was vulnerable and they um, pretty much showed their vulnerable side and I like that. This is gonna sound crazy, but I really like Riley, even though, you know, she got eliminated second, but her, uh, I feel like her, um, I guess charisma and her, um, personality was really shown through even though she wasn't you know a part of the a lot of the photo shoots you know but I really liked her um, personality least favorite putting me on the spot let me see um, tall got the blonde and is it the blonde okay. yeah um, Anthony did come off as a little cocky, um, a little overconfident, and um, that to me was uh, kind of a, uh, just not my thing. That sounds bad, right? <laughs> Sorry. I think what do I what I bring to the series is a little edgy, a little edgy, gothy. Um, punk style, I guess. I like dark colors. I like dark mascara. I like <laughs> things like that. So um, you'll see that side of me in the photo shoots. And um, I also think I bring like a genuineness that um, a lot of people have told me that I have. Um, compassion. Um, I just really like to help people and um, I'm a great listener. So I think that's uh, an advantage. And I, um, I think that my strategies will hopefully um, be an advantage because I've watched every season of Survivor. So hopefully that'll shine through and it'll help me in the long run. So this is a competition and the people that are gonna be seen as threats, um, those would be my go-to. <laughs> um, uh, just because that's 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 how I'm gonna play the game. Like if you're a threat, then I need that, you know. But if they're a part of my alliance, then that's a different story. I think I'm also a very loyal person. So if if they're a part of, if, if I say I got your back, I got your back. I'm not gonna turn around and you know stab you in the back. In this moment, um, I'm excited and I'm also nervous, but I'm just an anxious person. But that's something, that's uh, actually one of the reasons that I chose to do this is because I wanna challenge myself to get out of my comfort zone and to do something new and 
hopefully it'll be, you know, I, I mean, I know it's going to be a good experience and um, I'm make new friends and, um, you know, make a lot of memories. Ho hopefully good memories. <laughs> I just hope it's overall a good experience and a fun experience and something that I can take, you know, um, look back on and be like, I'm so glad I did that. I do identify as non-binary and that's something that I've struggled with, especially living in, in the South. Um, and so it's taken me a long time, a lot of therapy to get to where I am. And I hope that shines through and um, can be something, um, I guess a good role model in a sense to other people who, um, you know, are working on themselves and challenging themselves to get out there and actually truly be themselves. Um, and I guess that's it. Hi! Hey, what's up? Hey. How are you? Hey. Hello! Hi, how are you? Hi. Angel, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Michael. Danny. Danny, nice, nice to meet, meet you as well, Michael. Hi, I'm Anne-Marie, nice to meet you. Anne-Marie? Anne-Marie, nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. Yes. You know me. Take a seat. I know of you. I've seen that face before. How I've are you? Show. I'm good, how are you? Good. Very good. What are you up to? Dude. Just chilling. Chilling. Yeah. I got in like a couple hours ago, so. Oh, that's today. Yeah, I just got in today. Yeah. Good chilling, you know. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Man. How was your flight? Did you go to? Yeah. Oh yeah, it was fine. Um, I almost missed it, but. <laughs> oh, <really? laughs> well, well, yeah, you I, 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 was, I was, I was just trying to. I don't know. I got distracted. I was trying to do my post saying that you know I was going to be gone for yeah. a while. And then I had my earpods in, and then next thing you know, they're like, "We're about to leave," and I'm like, "Shit, I gotta go." Oh. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I made it. So that's what's going on here. That's what matters. Yeah. So yeah. where where are you originally from? Mm -hmm. I'm from Durant, Oklahoma. Oh, oh okay. okay. That's where my tribe resides. So nice. it's kind of like the reservation on there. Very my nice. tribe's Choctaw. So okay. Native American. Okay. Yeah. okay. All right. Yeah. All right. So, that's so cool. I was actually yeah. just telling these guys I grew up going to. Down to Oklahoma, my family has a farm. Oh, there. yeah, yeah. Disney, Oklahoma, are you familiar? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, Disney, yeah, Oklahoma. 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 Super small. No, I heard that name. Super small. <laughs> small. Like, no, I grew up in a very, very small town. My actually graduating class was 18 people. So. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's okay. Really, really small. Okay. small. Okay. Jay Franklin. Um, my hometown is, oh, sorry, I'm 22. My hometown is Afton, which is in St. Louis. So, <laughs> did I miss a question? My name is Roger Franklin. I am 22. Um, my hometown is Afton, and I am representing St. Louis, Missouri. I bartend at Mission Taco, and I bartend at Hooters also. Um, I, what, for fun, I like to just hang out with my friends. We have, I have a lot of uh, bartender friends and we go downtown and we just have great Friday and Saturday nights because we're all industry workers. So I have no modeling experience <laughs> at all. <laughs> so I'm very, I'm excited, but nervous and excited to see how everything turns out. Well, I'm kind of biased on who my favorite cast member was in season one, because I know Riley, but I also love her attitude, her pictures. She's a great model, so. Yeah. <laughs> I love to have fun and like I love to be supportive and I feel like I have like a really like big like personality overall and I just hope like everybody gets along and we just I'm here to have a great time and do my best. <laughs> so my game strategy is honestly just to vote and like stick true to like myself and who I think is doing great or whose photos are good or who I think would be a good you know champ person. So I just want to vote according to that and not just based on like friends who like if anybody we have drama I hope we don't I don't plan to have any drama <laughs> but um that's how I want to vote I want to vote like genuinely because it's about more than modeling it's about like your characteristics and you being a champ and all that so okay I'm very worried since we already talked about how I've never had modeling experience <laughs> I'm worried I'm going to look interesting for my first photo shoot which is fine but I just I want to get it together before this is over um I am nervous because I really I've never I've never modeled in my life and I haven't really worn like cute clothes or like bikinis for a very long time. Um, I just lost a lot of weight recently, so this is all very new. Everything is very new, but I'm looking very I'm looking forward to 
just, you know, being excited and like getting the experience and like being able to say that like I did this and had the opportunity and meet new people. I get to meet new people from, I don't know, they're not all from St. Louis though. So I'm excited to meet new people from other states and make new friends. Um, my final thoughts are, um, I'm just excited to be here. Like I'm already having fun. We, ha I, we haven't really done anything yet, but I'm just happy to be in Florida and to have the opportunity to do something like this. It's really cool and I'm excited. Hi everybody! Hey. Hey. Hi! Hi! Hi, my name is Roger. Hey, nice to meet you. What's your name? Michael. Michael, okay. Hey, yeah. so nice to meet oh, you. Nice to meet you. I'm Danny. Nice to meet you. Danny, nice to meet you. Oh, Hi, I'm Anne Marie. Hi, it's nice, nice to, meet to meet you. you. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name is Roger. Okay, okay. Oh shit, my heels are taking me out. Okay. Roger. 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 I remember that So when I walked in and I saw Anthony was here, it was funny because he went to introduce himself and I was like, obviously I'm from season one. Anthony, I got it. <laughs> you don't gotta introduce yourself. We know you. <laughs> How are you guys doing? How was your trip here? It was good. Mine was easy. Yeah. It was good. Yeah. Yeah. It was I'm good. So excited. Simple. I'm excited too. Yeah. I'm very excited. Yeah. Tonight. My name is Darius Palmer, I'm 27, and I'm from St. Louis, Missouri. Right now, I'm a bar back at um, Ballpark, and I also play rugby. Rugby is like my passion, I love everything about it. I'm thinking about coaching into it or starting a YouTube channel. What I enjoy most is the comedy. It was very unexpected, like you didn't know what was gonna happen next. And like what caught me off guard, Riley got eliminated first, and I was just like, whoa, like, so you know the competition is like, it's very fair, like, so that stood out the most to me. Uh, I would say the guy who won, I felt like he was real humble. It seemed like he was just there for business. Just took action and really like when the drama and all that was going on, he kept his composure and just stick to the script. So I think I admire that most about him. Dang, it's getting on the air. Uh, What's the, uh, dang, you might hate me for this. Um, The guy who, um. Dang, um, he's a UFC fighter. I have to say Anthony is my like least favorite. Sorry, Anthony, but yeah, I'll say him. I'll say my energy, like hype energy, excitement, um, always down to have fun. Um I'm just I honestly say me, like, and dancing too. So I'm I'm gonna bring a good vibe, like, just be like happy all the way together to it. My social game, I would say probably like getting to know everybody. Um, honestly, I don't think I really have a game because this is my first time like doing something like this, but I'm gonna discover my new social game. So honestly, but if I could say just like being nice to everybody and just being real open-minded to different ideas and, and open-minded to whatever is like coming. So I think that will take me a long way with this. I have thought about my voting strategy. I know that's gonna be real intense. That's gonna be hard, especially like if I like like survive like the later rounds and like I, and you have to like if there's somebody on the show that you click with you're gonna have to like vote them off that's gonna be hard and then you gotta show it I'm like look it's not what it looks like I was forced to do it so I'm gonna have to deal with that I'm gonna have to explain a lot to some people but you know it is what it is some people gonna be voting me off so I'm dating right now um single ready to mingle date I got a lot of girlfriends right now so I'm just dating around seeing what I like I'm looking forward to just, honestly, the hot tub, but nah, um, I'm honestly looking forward to, I can, to be honest with you, just the experience itself, like, I've never done nothing like this, like, and I want to do, I want to become a YouTuber, so just like, all of this, all of this, like, the cameras and everything, I'm taking this all in, so like, this moment right here, right now, like, I'm looking, like, I'm looking forward to this right here, just everything, I really can't answer that question, it's all, all of it because I love YouTube and I really want to become a YouTuber. So, man, it's all, all of this. Tune in, what's an well, exciting season this year? So I like real have to say. Hello. Oh my God. Hello. 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 H
Darius, nice to meet you. My name is Roger, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, me too. Oh. How you doing? Hi, Angel, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Hey, Danny. Nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Anne Marie, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Oh, you guys are not drinking? Oh, you guys are not drinking. Hey, you need to catch up. I love that. Y'all were looking at me. That was like the first thing we did was like, what's your guess? We're bringing the whole house. I love that. Essentials, right? Right. I know what your essentials are. As long as yeah. alcohol, that's my essential. Like, I'm like, the alcohol and like, Group as a whole, everybody was like real welcoming. It feel like it's a cool little chill vibe right now. Everybody like, kind of like getting to know each other. Everybody's like in a good, happy mood right now. Oh yeah, there's yeah. one more coming. There's at least one more person uh, coming. Seven. 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 I think there's one person. more person. I don't know when, but I think there's one more person coming. Yeah, I think there's two. We're missing a girl. A guy or a girl? A girl. Yeah. Because there's three of us. Oh, so yeah, there is. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We're outnumbered. Because ours was guy, girl, guy, yeah. girl. Then I guy, was girl, third, guy. And then. I still think there's one. When then last season, there's a girl couple, right? There's 10, yeah. Yeah, 5 and 5. Yeah. So. Yeah. Interesting. And I honestly think the next girl is going to be a returner. Damn. Really? Yo. I guess you're right, because we're so. all newbies with. Yeah. I don't know that makes sense. I honestly yeah. think that's going to be the returner. Oh. And I don't know who it's going to be, but for some reason, in my, in my mind, I think it's going to be. No, I think you're right now. I think it's going to be who? Bree. Bree? Yeah, I have no clue. I have, I have no clue. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I Mason Fitzpatrick. I'm 31 years old. So my hometown is Tampa, Florida, and I'm currently living in Cincinnati, Ohio. Um, I'm a photographer right now. I take pictures of new home builds, um, but I'm trying to get into wildlife photography because that is where my heart's at. Um, what I like to do for fun, besides that, working out, going out, going outside, doing stuff with my animals, um, traveling, meeting new people. Um, Pretty much down for anything. Um, I honestly don't have too much modeling experience. I've done uh, a few projects here and there with other LGBT um, people throughout my life. I've done some calendars and stuff like that, but this is the first time I've done anything like this. So I just want to be me and I want to be myself. And um, I think I try my best to make people smile and bring the best in any situation. And I'm just excited to um, get outside of my own way and hopefully help somebody else in the process. So. I think the, the most important thing for me personally walking into this is not having a strategy and overthinking it um, because that's my biggest problem. So I just want to have fun and um, I kind of prove myself wrong if, if anything else. So I, I think the strategy is honestly just going in and having fun and not overthinking it because that's one of my favorite things to do. So. Yeah, I mean, I think alliances are super important and I'm, I'm definitely hoping to make some while I'm here, but uh, yeah, I mean, I just I just want them to be a good person as well. So. Ashley and I have been together for a uh, little over two years now. She's why I moved to uh, Cincinnati. Um, she's also the reason why I'm here. She's my biggest cheerleader and someone who uh, definitely helps remind me of things that I need to better remind myself, but um, there's not enough good things I could say about her. Um, she's the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. And um, I'm excited to see where this takes me so that hopefully I can take us even further. So I'm lucky to have her. I think the only thing I'm nervous about is posing in front of the camera. It's like the worst thing that I'm, <laughs> I'm so bad at it. Um, but I think I'm gonna use it as my, my challenge to just, again, have fun not take myself so seriously and have a good time. And, um, but I'm, I'm excited about it all. Not walking into something and not having any idea what you're doing or what the next day is gonna bring uh, is pretty crazy, but it's part of the ride and I'm excited. Um, my first thoughts when I saw Mason, I've been following him on social media media forever. So in all honesty, I was 
As you could tell by my reaction, I was completely shocked that it was him. I honestly thought that it was gonna be a girl returner, but when I saw him, it was like, I was like, there's no way. Like, I can't believe like that he's actually like here. Like, um, I've been following him forever. He's been like a uh, inspiration for me. Um, so it was really nice to like see him come come in. Obviously, he does not know who I am, but I've been following him for forever. So it was it was a shock to see him come in. I feel like when I had that reaction, everyone was like, <laughs> "Wow! Like, do they know each other?" How are you? Hi, Angel. Nice to meet you. Anthony, nice to meet you. No I'm Danny. Hi, nice, nice to meet you. you. Hi, my name's Roger. Nice What's your name? Hi. Mason? Okay. Mason. Nice to meet you. Michael. Yeah. Gary, it's nice to meet you. Gary. And they all know each other. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. So the last group of people came in, and I think it literally shook the house. Like, it's crazy. Um, I think the first things I see right off the bat is I know Rajay and Darius know each other. So I, secret, I do know Darius. <laughs> we are still acting a little bit like we don't know each other because um, we don't want like any votes to be like based off that because we might be friends, but like we're still here to do the same thing. So we don't really want to be judged on that. But um, I hope we plan to tell the group soon because I do want them to know. Okay. Oh, we were all wrong. We were all wrong. We were all, all of wrong. us were wrong. Right. Okay, so, okay, you know what we need oh, to know? Yes. We need to know your age and your sign. Um, <laughs> what do you think my sign is? I think I don't have talked to you too long. You. Okay, can I ask you some more questions just, for just you? Yes. Sorry. You yeah, can yeah, absolutely. Okay, okay, okay. What's your, what, where do you work? What do you do? I'm a photographer. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Okay, 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 okay. Are you analytical? What's another? Okay, yes. Okay. You gave me Virgo, right. but Are you logical? You're logical. Okay, okay, okay. I'm guessing Virgo. No, 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 because no. I feel like, I feel like, no, I feel like, how do you guys do that? What? You're a Virgo? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah! Right on the money! Right on the money! I know that! I'm Mason. Super cool guy. Um, he's, for, he's a photographer. He's super nice. Um, he... He's very uh, first impression shy, I think, a little bit. He's, you know, he's a little bit out of his comfort zone when it comes to modeling. Um, I'm looking forward to, get to getting to know him too. He's. He's kind of like me when it comes to, I guess, um, not used to being in front of the camera and kind of being um, a little on the shyer side. Yes. I am just, I'm oh, literally so happy to literally have just a decent like picture of myself. Like this is amazing. I felt very warm when I walked in. Like I have already made some very close connections with some people. Like um, I really love Michael. And Danny, I love them both so much. They have very like vibrant personalities and like I just I just like the way they move. I think they're great people. But I really like everybody on the season so far. Um, they're all pretty good people. They're very like genuine. We already talked about how we don't really want to have any drama or anything. And I think that was a big step with all of us bonding. I saw Rajay walk by um, Angel at one point and it was just kind of this like tight vibe and I get that, like, she's 22 at the end of the day, and it's probably coming from a place of just, you know, being in a new environment, you're maybe a little insecure and trying to, like, overcompensate in some ways, and I think that that's just visible to people who maybe have had a little life experience, and I think having grace in that is totally, like, needed. Um, but there's a clear division in the house already, and I gotta try and, like, not be so clear in that division um but at the end of the day like i guarantee you it's gonna clearly come down and everybody's gonna know like it's four and four how are you about to play flip up with grandpa oh, 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 we should do it on this table oh, it's, it's bigger uh, hey nobody eat okay, yeah. we could right. oh, because we could do it four and four as anthony being the only returner i'm still like I'm still like in shock about it. I honestly thought there was gonna at least be one one more returner. So um, him just being the only returner, I, it still makes me kind of wonder like why just him? I feel like maybe there might be a twist at some point in it where maybe somebody randomly comes back for even if it's like one challenge or something like that. But um, 
him being the only returner, it still puts like a question in my mind on like just why one returner. <laughs> you need to be careful. You're gonna cut yourself. No, no, she got it. 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 She got the first four people that were here, uh, IRI first, then Angel, then Danny, and then uh, Anne, Anne Marie, there's kind of already like, like an alliance there, um, but it's more or less like, like, um, like a non-spoken agreement so far is what I've, I've realized with um, what's going on. Well, I have something for you, and I would like you to read it. And then let me know your thoughts. Oh, wow. Legacy advantage. It says, Anthony, welcome back for season two. As a return to this competition, you know how the game works. Here's a welcome back gift from one chant to another. This legacy adventure provides you with, with immunity for a knockout vote in this competition. Use this wisely because you can only use the swans on yourself before the fourth knockout vote. Best of luck this season. That's pretty cool. Kind of takes that target off my back. Um, kind of right off the bat. So that's kind of, kind of cool. I mean, that saves me a little bit. <laughs> so I feel appreciative and super cool that I get that. So. I was hoping there would be one more returner, so if need be, we could try to, you know, bounce off each other and win a couple of challenges, but I'll win a challenge and protect myself when I need to. <laughs> so I'll be around for a while. Champ Coastal! One, two, three, Champ Coastal! Getting to hear just, again, everyone's stories. Um, Anne-Marie, like, everything about her just moving here and, um, I don't know, I feel like I've got I've gotten a little time to kind of connect with everybody and get to everybody's stories and uh, we're very different. So um, I've kind of had a little bit little bit of a connection with, with everybody. Are we gonna all play a game? Yeah. So we gotta put we gotta clothes on. So yeah. I'm gonna put clothes on. I'm gonna call them the newbies as of right now. But the newbies that came in, um, I honestly think that they're they're really, really cool. Um, I think you know, where it's, it's, they came like kind of later in the day, so I feel like we don't really have like too much time to really like get to know, know, know them, know them. But um, from first impressions, I honestly think that their, that their vibe is really good and everything like that. I think that honestly, I would get along with pretty much all of them. Um, I just want to say that I, I just want to, to let y'all know kind of where I'm coming from when it comes to, because I know this is a reality show and we're supposed to be partying it up. But I spent three months in rehab okay. mm -hmm. um, a year ago and I lost two jobs because of mm -hmm. that. And so I just want to let y'all know that, you know, I can have a glass of wine every once in a while or things like that. But when it comes to shots or drinking games, um, when I got out of rehab, I went 11 months not drinking. You bad bitch. <laughs> Thank you. Hey bro, I'm happy for you, man. Hey, I'm going. so happy for you. I'm so, so proud of you. Keep it up, baby. Immediately who I clicked with obviously was Roger, just because she's very outspoken. She's very, um, I don't know, we were in the hot tub together and we were just hanging out and she, she um, just expressed, um, we just got to know each other a little bit more. And uh, you know, I told everybody about the um, me going to rehab and um, recovering, you know, um, in my addiction and everything. And so she was just very sincere about that. And she said, you know, being Roger, like, um, I'll fight anybody who tries to like, you know, give you a shot or peer pressures you and things like that. And she's just, she really sincerely told me, sincerely told me that she got my back. And um, so at this point she's, um, 
the person that I click with the most. Yeah. We can always do like, we can always give you like, if we're taking shots, like I do this like yeah, water all the time water. with a girl who doesn't like to do shots. You can do water. juice, you can have wine, you can yeah. do water, whatever yeah. you want. We just want you to be included. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like, it can be whatever the fuck you want it to be. Okay. Okay. We don't give a fuck. We just want you to yeah. be included and not be left I, out. I want to play. Don't play. No, like, yeah. 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 no, you can fucking play. You gotta you be on my team. Play. Like, we're gonna win. So. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. No, I want it. I will smack you. I'll smack you with it. Do it. Hold on. Let me wait. First impressions of the group as a whole. Um, yeah, I would say, you know, first impressions of the group. I have the first four that I arrived on the same time with, you know, that's Danny, um, Anne Marie, and um, Anthony. So I still feel very posy vibes, great vibes with them. You know, the new, the newbies are, um, uh, Rajay, Michael, and Darius. And overall, I think the group overall <laughs> will mesh well. I'm not sure about some individual situations, but I think in general, it'll be okay. <laughs> All right, full transparency. I'm not sure I'm going to click very well with uh, Rajay. She's a little She's a lot for me personally, like a lot energy wise and a lot vocally. She's just a lot, just a lot. And I, it just doesn't mesh well with my personality, but I think she outside of that objectively looks to be a great person and, and possibly a great model. I haven't seen her shoot yet, but I'm sure she's great at it, you know? So, but personally, I'm not sure we'll, will mesh very well so i'll just keep my distance really? that's why i had such the reaction <laughs> you look so yeah. fucking familiar you know what my first thoughts on mason that's actually why i forgot to mention him is because he was so stoic and so just this cool quiet confidence about him that's actually why i like him a lot i forgot to mention him because i started assuming he was part of the original four because he's just he just has this great energy about him that's very it draws me to him. I, I vibe with him very well. And we've only exchanged just a few words. But I can tell that I, I'm a click I'm going to click with him very well. And I can say from speaking with other people that he definitely is a, is somebody that I would like to communicate more with and, and kind of have in my corner. I, when I walked in, like, he was already here and I knew who he was, but I pretended just, like, to not <laughs> I knew you knew. You I know. Like, yeah, because my so eyes are like, oh I was like, absolutely not. There's no way. <laughs> I was the second person here and I instantly was like, what's up? I know you. <laughs> what's going on? show. What's up? <laughs> People will judge and, you know, believe whatever. And I've already gotten some kind of weird vibes from a couple people. Um, and at the end of the day, it's like, if they're gonna judge you based on a first impression that they don't even know you, like, then that's great. So, Michael, I, he, I can already tell instantly there's some kind of, he's not vibing with me. Um, and that's cool. And I can see through the fakeness and so it's just being aware of that. And I think being a little older sometimes in a group is an advantage because you've been through that and you've seen it. Um, and yeah, and I think lead by example, like I'm gonna be open, I'm gonna be positive, I'm gonna be me. And I hope that someone will value that, yeah. Um, going into tomorrow, my mindset is just gonna be like, take it as it comes. You know, I honestly don't know what to expect. I don't know what type of, you know, challenge is going to be, you know, for tomorrow, but I'm going to, you know, try and give it my all and, you know, take it as it is. Um, I mean, I hope it's, you know, something easy. You got me on my toes right now, bro. I ain't going to lie. I don't know what to expect. Like, man, I just, I don't know. We in Florida, it's about to get lit. That's what I expect, yo. I think it's going to be challenging. Um, but this is why we're here. Like, screw sleep, you're gonna be tired, that's life. Like, you're not always fresh, you have to perform when you're not feeling your best. And I, that's why I'm here. And I just absolutely can't wait to rock it tomorrow. Yeah, my expectations for tomorrow are, um, I don't have any because I think I'm just 
expecting to be surprised. I'm not really, I think that tomorrow is going to be the first challenge and I think it's going to be something that throws everybody out of their comfort zone. I think anybody who walks into tomorrow thinking that their hot shit is going to be thrown to the wall and realize that they have some growth to do, which is what we all need to do. We all have growth to do. The competition just like went up. Next week on Champ Coastal. Welcome to season two of the Champ Series. Can I steal the floor? We will be recreating iconic photos of the one and only. Listen up. Oh, what's up? Me and her jam. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm gonna tell you guys. Hey!